in today's video i want to teach you on how you can send an alligator pepper and errand to go and fight any man or woman that said that it shall not be well with you any man or woman that is using your destiny to shine any man or woman that has vowed that you will not succeed any man or woman that have said that all you are doing that you are not going to achieve success so in today's video is really a very powerful prayer or a very powerful ritual that you are you are to use an alligator pepper to fight this battle remember i told you that alligator is a spirit and alligator pepper does not go in shameful message so relax and follow me to the end of this video to know how exactly you are going to use this alligator pepper how many seed and how exactly you need to do that all right so stay blessed and let's go good morning to you all good afternoon and good evening i am greeting you depending on wherever you are watching me from and exactly when you see this video you are highly welcome to my channel welcome to our channel if today is your first time you are highly welcome my name is promise in case if you are seeing my voice for the first time in this channel i talk about the spiritual tips all right health tips as well we have other channel where we talk about the lifetime and beauty tips so if you want to join this channel please request for the link on the comment section i'm going to drop it there so you join and listen to an amazing and interested content as well right now today i want to talk on how you can use an alligator paper to fight your battle whosoever whatever the person is doing no matter whoever the person are no matter how powerful the person is remember alligator paper is a powerful and a very spiritual weapon you will use to you can use to fight anybody that is fighting against you so today we are want to do this video practically so that you will not go and make mistake while doing this recipe but before i go on saying this please if you want to perform this recipe you must make sure that you have not planned evil against somebody that your hands are clean that you have not murdered somebody that you have not done evil before please if you have done any of this don't do this recipe please if you know that your hands are not clean in most of the times i used to tell you that oh whenever you want to use alligator pepper for any special reason please don't make sure that your hands are clean and it's very very important because alligator pepper is a spirit you don't deceive you can deceive human you cannot deceive spirit all right that's why it's a fruit yes it's just a creature it's a fruit but believe me when it comes to spiritual aspect of it it's a wonderful powerful and effective weapon you can use to fight your battle now before i go on to this video somebody called me outside the country and he said from you see after helping my people after uh feeding my people after i got so many complaints that my village uh they are suffering there is no food there is no this and i i have that kind of pity and i sent a lot of money a lot of money that i cannot mention a lot of money this is billions of money out of his will willingly he sent it oh let my people be fueled oh let my people be joyed let my people rejoice and enjoy their life and after doing this charity work the guy gone from up to down that he find it so difficult to feed you can imagine the wicked world we are into just in the name of helping my people in the name of oh let me assist people and i got so many calls again that oh lady pc after i helped my uncle you know my uncle was sick and i i sent money to them to take care of him and after that all my contract closed really i am not i'm not really really happy because some people are very wicked some people are very very heartless somebody decided to help you with his or hard earned money you decided to use it against that person believe me the heaven and the earth will fight you so please if you are using this recipe you must make sure that your hands are clean if not so revise may be the case but if you know that your hands are clean and you notice that somebody is using your destiny or somebody is the cause of your problem or that somebody is the is manipulating you whether the who wherever kingdom the person belong to wherever power the person is using 
as long as that person is the reason you are passing through that particular thing after doing this recipe believe me <laughs> believe me something great is going to happen but you that is doing it sit yourself down ask yourself some question am i sure i am qualified to do this recipe if you are really sure of doing that do it and i'm waiting for your testimony then how do you do that number one you need an alligator pepper so this is my alligator pepper i got this alligator pepper newly you know we have the previous ones we previous one we use for spiritual recipe but i just got this new one because i just want to show you from the start on how to go about doing this recipe if you are a mother you can do this prayer for your children all right if you are up to 18 years you can go ahead and make this prayer now what do you know what do you do sorry before i go if you have done abortion before please go for cleansing before you do this recipe in case if you are joining us for the first time you have not seen any video for abortion cleansing i've done that video so please take your time go through other videos don't come and call me and say let me tell me please go through other videos i have more than 1000 messages to reply so since the answer is already on the channel please take your time go to the videos i have more than 20 different ways you can go for cleansing so go through cleansing before you do the recipe now we'll go so this is an alligator pepper number one thing before you do it all right before you do it get it like this when you get alligator pepper like this first of four bury this alligator pepper for seven days buried it for seven days place on the ground buried it for seven days then after the seven days go and bring it out all right after bringing it out now what do you do number one i told you before you use an alligator pepper for a special recipe or for a special reason you need to open your alligator pepper from the back and we are going to do it now and then now 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 this is this alligator pepper i have not opened it before you see now i'm going to show you how to open it when you want to use it for special reasons i'm going to take this alligator pepper at my back you see when i take it at my back i am opening it already from my back and please when you are opening it make sure that no seed fall down if any seed fall down when you are opening it that one is not good for the work again you need to get another one okay now i've opened it from my back but i did not remove the seed you know now i brought it to my front so this is it i have opened this alligator pepper now because of this uh, this alligator pepper has been open for spiritual reasons so anytime you want to do anything that has to do with spiritual reasons you can use this particular alligator pepper is fine now in doing this you need eight seeds of alligator pepper now i'm going to count eight seed out of this alligator pepper i have one two three four five six seven and eight okay now this is my eight seeds of alligator pepper i think somebody can see on the screen now what do i need to do in doing this i'm going to this is eight all right now i'm going to take one of this alligator pepper and put it in my mouth i think you can see it one is already on my in my mouth now i'm going to take just one one seed on my right hand and the, the remaining six is on my left hand now we'll begin the journey now what you need to do is this bring this one in your right hand all right close to your mouth don't chew the one in your mouth just leave it there the way it is this is a very powerful prayer or ritual whenever somebody is tormenting you or whenever you feel you help somebody and that person uses it against you or whenever you think that somebody is using your testing after doing this this person the person will never resist it that is if only your hands are clean now bring this number this right one in your hand this recipe is going to be done early morning early morning immediately you wake up early morning without talking to anybody without greeting anybody 
you just wake up with you, your guardian angel, your God that just wake up, you go ahead and do this. Now, you are going to call your name four times. My name is Promise, right? Promise, 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 promise. This is my name. And since I have been, since I was born till now, I have never planned evil against somebody. I have not, I've never murdered anybody. I have never been in a means whereby they are discussing anything against anybody and I remained there or I kept quiet. Therefore, I am using this alligator pepper as a, as a point of contact or as a witness. Now, alligator pepper, you are a spirit. If you know how to speak Igbo, you will use Igbo to make this prayer. I don't know if I can say it in Igbo. It will be more better like... Okay, maybe after saying it in Igbo, I will still say it. I've already said it in English. Now, you said, uh, my name is Promise, right? The son of, I will not tell you that one. I will just said, call anything. Now, I mean the daughter of somebody. Now, you will say, if you are praying with Igbo, or it's more better if you can pray with your own native language, wherever you are coming from. Now, let me use mine. Promise. Mwa okeke. Promise. Mwa okeke. Promise. Mwa okeke. Promise. Mwa okeke. That is four times I called my name. Alligator pepper. Ibu spirit. O soji. Enaye jiji here. O soji. Ine jije. Ne bezi he bezi. Enaye jije. Megi dem madu. So anima boki. Nasi e bobona. Ma woke ma wan. Amoro no wa, amoro na obosi eke, amoro no obosi ore, amoro no obosi afo, amoro no obosi nkwa. Aka ya dini hem na aga biga, aka ya dini hem na ane mem, aka ya dini an sobo an na aga, an na, an sobo a, ne sobo m, aka ya dina, waga ni rua, madara aga. Maka ni ibu spirit, andi ima na aka modi ocha, ibu bero mo madu. Onwebe ronyi hea na agara nkoma akosimia. Onwebe ronyi meru mi hea. Meru mi aje bere. Ana ma asigi gibu aligeto. Gibu o soji. Ki je lo olo mogwa. Go and fight this battle for me. Please let me speak my grammar. So that the video will not be too long. Go and fight this battle. For me. Alright. Now I call you. Any man or woman. That is using my destiny to shine. Whether or not the person is a winch, whether the person is a wizard, whether the person is a occultic, whether the person is a evil, whether any kingdom that person belongs to, I don't know. I don't belong in any because my hands are clean. I always believe on my God, my guardian angel, the God of my ancestors, the God of the universe, the God of the heaven and earth. All right? That above who's, wherever the person is, that you alligator pepper go and fight this person as i finish doing this thing from now till four days which is the four market days the four pillar of the earth as i do this every any day the person will wake up whether in a k whether in ori whether in alpha whether in Nkwa, then if you are not Igbo and you don't know your native language you can say whether on Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, any day that person wakes up and go out to step on this sand, as I throw this, as I feed this out, let that person somersault and die. Let that person release whatever that belongs to me. All right? Then after making these prayers, serious prayer, then what you need to do? The one that you put in your hand, then after that, this one that you have speaking to, you have spoken to in your right hand, you go outside and throw it away. Just this one. And he said that as you are throwing this thing away, all right, that that is how, if that person will refuse to repent, to reduce you from whatever that is he or she is using to hold you, whether now winch, whether now wizard, whether now cortic, whether now anybody the person is, that 
let the person release what belongs to you. You say this three times and you throw this particular one away. Then after throwing this particular one away, you, you use this remaining six in your hand, all right? The remaining seed, that is six. Put it in your mouth again, added with the one already in your mouth. Then you're going to pray and bless your day. That is seven seed. I'm going to, don't do it to, look at that, still on my mouth. Then you put it, when you put the seed, added to the previous one, it becomes seven. Now, that is the number you use to bless either somebody or your business anytime you want to bless. Then you put it and you start blessing yourself. That from today, that every door that have closed in your life will be open. That those that have forgotten you, they will remember you. That job that they refuse you, they will call you for that job. Use this particular one to bless yourself. Everything that you want, everything good you want to happen to your life. That is what you are using this particular one to do. All right? Then after that, you shoot this one. It's preferish, I think you know. Then you shoot this one. Then you swallow it. All right? Now, for this one, the, the that particular one you put on your right hand, you use and make all this prayer. That one, you are going to throw it away. Then after throwing it away, relax and go and sit down and see what God will do and see what the God of the universe will do. You are going to see anybody or any man or woman that is his or her hand is in whatever you are passing through. You are going to hear a story about that person. All right. This recipe really, it works very well, but it's really very difficult for people to do it because that is if your hands are clean. You know what that means. So if you know you are not sure of yourself, if you know that, oh, I've forgotten what I've done maybe 10 years ago, please don't go. Don't, don't even try to do this prayer. But if you know, 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 know that you are pure, your hands are clean, you've not done any of those, go ahead and make this prayer. And believe me, you are coming back to testify. So I wish I share with you enough of this nonsense, all right? And our God will always save us thank you for watching if you follow me to the end of this video i love you always so if you love the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up please don't mind my ebo you know don't mind that ebo i'm sorry for those that did not hear me but it's exactly what i said is what i interpreted in that language so it's all the same so thank you for watching and see you in my next video see your girl promise saying bye